the use of radio waves to detect objects beyond the range of sight was first developed into a practical technology by engineers, in the 1930s. This new equipment, known as radar, radio detection and ranging, would play a major role during the Second World War and in subsequent conflicts. Radio waves are used to detect an object at a distance by transmitting a burst of radio energy, and measuring the time it takes for the echo caused by hitting the object to reflect back to the receiver. The height and bearing, or direction of flight, of targets can also be identified. By the outbreak of the Second World War in 1939, a chain of early warning radar stations, called chain home stations, had already been built along the south and east coasts of Britain. Radar could pick up incoming enemy aircraft at a range of 80 miles and played a crucial role in the Battle of Britain, by giving air defenses early warning of German attacks. The chain home stations were huge, static installations with steel transmitter masts over 100 meters high. But the invention of the cavity magnetron in 1940, which produced much more powerful radio waves with a shorter wavelength, allowed far more compact, powerful and sensitive radar units to be produced. This gave the Allies an important technological advantage over designs used by the Axis forces, and new equipment was developed rapidly for use in aircraft and ships and in land warfare.